Our team coverage continues now with an ABC 15 exclusive. Dog boarding facilities could now face more regulation. Sarah Goldenberg found some changes could be on the way. And Sarah, what did you learn? Well, Stephanie, lawmakers and dog owners are starting to gather support. They're pushing for more regulations so something like this never happens again. Green Acres, so these are Shannon Golden Gillette retrievers. lost two golden retrievers at Green Acres boarding facility in Gilbert. All that's left is their their collars. A few weeks later, so this is Cooper. Her family welcomed two rescue puppies into their home in their honor. It was just so empty without Sherman and Parker. So we really wanted to save one or two dogs' lives. MCSO is still investigating how 23 dogs died at the boarding facility. Now, looking back on it, had there been laws in place that some other states have, my dogs might be alive right now. State Representative Kate Brophy McGee is looking at making changes from licensing to inspections. We're just gathering the people who are in a position to put those options on the table, and certainly I could envision that being one. But she says it can get complicated, and she doesn't want to hurt the facilities that are doing everything right. The issue or the question that we have to ask is, will it work? Will it make it so that something like this does not happen again? Shannon wants more than regulations. She wants to see tougher animal cruelty laws put yeah. in place. Heartbreak that we feel as owners losing our two golden retrievers. We don't want any dog owner to, to ever have to go through what we're going through. Now, Brophy McGee tells me they're really in the early stages right now. She's reaching out to pet owners, and Sheriff Joe Arpaio is also involved. Meanwhile, MCSO is still investigating, and no arrests have been made in connection with what happened at Green Acres. Yeah, there have been so many twists and turns in this story. Of course, we'll continue to follow all of them. Sarah, thanks.